Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm Anthony Hitch, founder and owner of Quantum Voice AI, where we help industries like education, real estate, and financial services, even law firms, harness the real power of artificial intelligence. Whether you're a teacher, a school administrator, a college professor, or just someone deeply invested in the future of learning, this episode is specifically for you. Today, we're asking one of the most important questions in modern education. How is AI transforming classrooms and are we truly prepared for it? Let's talk about the truth, not the hype, the facts, not just the future. So grab your pen, your tablet, because this video is going to change the way you think about AI in education. AI in education isn't something on the horizon. It's happening right now, as in today. UNESCO has reported that over 40% of educational institutions globally have already adopted some form of AI-based learning or administrative tool. In the U.S. districts like Los Angeles Unified School District and universities like Arizona State University, shout out to those that went to that college, have implemented AI tutoring platforms to support both students and faculty. Tools like Conmingo by Khan Academy, uh, Socratic by Google, and Microsoft Copilot for Education are just a few examples where AI is already enhancing classroom engagement, reducing grading workload, and supporting personalized learning. So if you're an educator and you're listening, I have a question for you. As an educator, for you and your perspective, have you already started using tools like ChatGPT or Google's AI tools or Microsoft Copilot in your classroom? If so, What's your experience been like? Please comment below. Let's get into the practical, not just the theoretical for a minute here. AI can automate grading, saving teachers three to six hours per week on average for right now. And I see that scaling up as uh, the technology begins to mature. Or advance. It can also personalize curriculum to match student learning speeds and gaps. It can detect early warning signs of student disengagement or burnout by analyzing attendance, participation, and even tone in written assignments. And most importantly, AI does not replace educators. Let me say that one more time. AI does not, it does not replace educators. No. What it does do is it empowers educators. According to a 2024 Stanford University report, teachers who use AI for lesson planning and feedback saw up to 26% improvement in student performance over just one semester. So here's a reflection back to those that are in education. If you're a teacher, if you're a principal, if you are a counselor, um, what would your classroom look like if you had three to five extra hours just per week on average, right? What would it mean to you to spend more time teaching and less time doing paperwork? So here are real concerns and real conversations we need to have. But let's not ignore the valid concerns. What would those concerns be? Well, will AI widen the gap between well-funded schools and under-resourced districts? What about data privacy, especially 
when AI is analyzing student behavior. And let's ask the obvious and, and the human question, right? How do we maintain authentic relationships in a world where machines are interpreting human needs? These conversations, you know, these are conversations, not conclusions. And that's what I want to hear from you. I got a question. As an educator or a parent, maybe, right? How do you feel about AI interacting with students? Where do we draw the line between support and surveillance? So what's next and how to prepare as an educator in this year of 2025? AI isn't coming to take over education. It's coming to redefine how we teach, how we support, and how we inspire students. Here's what you can do today. Learn about tools like Conmingo and Duolingo Max AI, uh, ChatGPT for educators, or Google Gemini. Some of you have probably heard of this, but many of you have not heard of these. What you also can do today is join free programs like Microsoft's AI for Educators or ISTE's AI certification. What you also can do today is start small, automate uh, quiz feedback, create custom study plans, or track student performance trends. I want to also add that this is not about robots teaching kids. It's about giving teachers basically superpowers to be able to control the classroom uh, a little bit more efficiently. Now, just to cut off everything, I want to be truthful and I want to be honest with you as I usually am, but this really hits home for me. If no one's told you lately if you're listening to this and you are an educator, I want you to hear me. I need you to listen to me. Your work as an educator matters. Let me say that again so we can sink into the heart. Okay. I need you to really listen in on this. Your work that you've been putting in, I don't care if it's five years, 10 years, one year, 20 years, 30 years, 50 years. <laughs> it doesn't matter if there's an, a lineage of educators Okay, in your family, your work as an educator matters. Okay, principals, counselors, mentees, mentors, teachers, people that are part of the Tur Teachers Association, your education, what you put forth, you as an educator, the work, the hours you've been putting in, that matters. You are shaping minds. Yes, you. You are preparing futures. Yes, you. And you. Mr. or Mrs. Educator or Mr. or Miss Educator, you are planting seeds that grow into tomorrow's leaders. Yes, you. From preschool to uh, 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 kindergarten to elementary school to middle school to high school to college to trade schools, what have you. From MIT to Harvard to LaSalle universities, it doesn't matter. OK. AI is just the tool. But you, you're still the guide, okay? You are still the heartbeat here. So I hope that helps secure you and really let you know that, at least in my opinion, you guys are the real heroes here. You, the teacher, you're the hero. If today's video gave you something to think about, let's keep this conversation going. What I would like you to do is like this video, subscribe to the channel for more deep dives on AI in education and innovation. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss the next one and share this with a fellow teacher, principal or education leader who needs to hear this. I would love to get their input. Now, <laughs> here's the good part. In the next video, okay, in the next video, we'll explore how Harvard 
Yes, Harvard University and MIT are using AI to reimagine higher education and admissions. You will not want to miss this. I'm Anthony Hitch. This is Quantum Voice AI. Stay innovative, stay informed, and as always, thank you for watching. See you in the next one. God bless you.